Hi, Flick here, the Fit Injector. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you're all staying safe during this very difficult time for everyone. I hope that we can all do our bit, all support each other, and get through this as quick as possible. As a lot of you know, I am not able to inject anyone at this time based on the regulations. So I am at home bringing you as much content as I can. And I have my little helper, Lucy Lane here. Hi, <laughs> to help me with this. So let's get started with more and more people seeking cosmetic injectables treatments for their frown lines, forehead creases, and crow's feet, and more people seeking this treatment as a preventative, as they become more educated about it, it is really important that you know about this treatment before you do get started. So now that you're listening, don't get I mean, don't get anti-wrinkle injections unless you are prepared for, we have a few, needles, pain, aftercare, risk factors, patience, prevention, and maintenance. Quite a few things for this uh, quick treatment. Firstly, with all cosmetic injectables treatments in Australia, you must be 18 to have the treatment. No, we will not treat you prior to this. However, most people seeking this type of cosmetic treatment are in their 20s and beyond. Oh, and if you were wondering what the bleep was for, I didn't swear, but consider it a swear word in the cosmetic world in Australia because we are not allowed to mention the exact brand names of the products across our social media platforms in any of our advertising, even though that is what people refer to this treatment as, it's actually a brand name. Hence why throughout this, and you'll see on my Instagram and TikTok and all of the platforms, we use the words anti-wrinkle injections. So don't get anti-wrinkle injections unless you are prepared for needles into your face, multiple injections. But the good news is it is a tiny needle and it's very, very quick. It only takes a couple of minutes to treat multiple areas of the face. And this treatment can be used in both the upper and lower face. Now there is no downtime with this treatment and I often refer to it as a lunchtime treatment because it is so quick. Which leads me into pain. Now, as we've talked about before, pain is a very subjective thing experienced very differently by all of us. Now, because the treatment is so quick, clients tolerate this very, very well. It does sting, I'm not going to lie about that, very, very tiny needle, but it stings when the product is going into the muscle. Now, most people report it feeling like you're getting your eyebrows waxed or plucked or threaded, can make the eyes water a little bit. And some people report it makes them feel like they need to sneeze, particularly when we are treating around, uh, around the frown and the forehead areas. But I've never had anyone who can't you know, continue with their treatment and once the results kick in, they say it was 100% worth it. Now you can also use a squeezy ball, gives you something to focus on, and we can use ice pre and post to keep you nice and comfortable. So you've had your treatment, now we need to look after it. Aftercare is really important with anti-wrinkle injections. And I'll explain why in a moment. So after the injections, we don't want you lying down for at least four hours. So you will have to skip that afternoon nap. We don't want you exercising, having massages or facials for about 24 hours. So you've got another nurse indicated rest day. We don't want you touching or rubbing the areas for the rest of the day. So being really gentle when you're removing makeup that evening. 
and we don't want you to have any other face treatments or any other injectables to those same areas for at least two weeks. Now the reason being, let's talk about the risks. Is your worst case scenario, less than 1% chance with anti-wrinkle injections is droopy muscle. In the upper face, that could be heavy or droopy brows. In the lower face, that could be a heavy or a wonky smile. Now, the good news is, is that if this does happen, extremely rare, it is temporary, it will wear off, it will recover as the product wears off. Now, the reason we don't want you laying down or exercising or doing other facials and things like that after your treatment is we don't want your product moving around into other areas of the face and potentially causing those droopy muscles. And then there's the other standard risk factors that come with injectables into the face, such as bleeding, bruising, swelling, and infection. All very rare with anti-wrinkle injections. Afterwards, most people have a little bit of redness to the area. That does settle down really quickly within about 15 to 20 minutes. And it's extremely rare for anyone to get any swelling or bruising after the treatment. In terms of infection, keeping the areas clean, just as you would with any other injectables treatment. Patience. Now, unlike your dermal filler treatments, anti-wrinkle injections are not an instant treatment. So injection virgins often come in one day before their big birthday bash and they want all their lines smoothed and gone before their birthday. Then I'm the bearer of bad news because I tell them it's too late. So injections take three to five days to start taking effect and up to a full two weeks for that full result. So please, if you have an event coming up and it is your first time of having treatment, plan ahead to avoid disappointment. Now, what do I mean by preventative? Well, anti-wrinkle injections are really beneficial when we use them as a preventative treatment. I love it when clients tell me that they are considering anti-wrinkle injections as a preventative. When we're having our consultation, we're having a look at their face in the mirror, they don't have lines and wrinkles at rest yet, but they are expressive when they, they are moving their face and they're saying to me, I want to start this because I don't want to get those lines. I get really excited about that because most people I find, think that they don't need to start the anti-wrinkle injections until they have those lines and creases at rest. And they'll come in with their never treated before furrows. And I'm talking literally furrows in the face. And they get really disappointed when I tell them that we can't restore those areas to what they looked like when they were in their 20s. Because those creases are deep, they are at rest. What the treatment can do at that point is it will soften them and it will also help to stop them getting deeper, but they're not going to do one treatment and have this completely smooth frown and forehead. In saying that, I do have clients in their 20s who are very expressive and they do have those frown and forehead lines or maybe around the eyes or other areas. And that was me. And a lot of people you know, say, oh, oh, you're so young, or why did you start so young? And it's like, well, this, look at this, smooth. I was a 20 year old with deep frown and forehead lines from being really expressive throughout my whole life. And yes, I started the treatment in my 20s, but what I've done is I've softened those areas, I've smoothed those areas, and I'm preventing those lines forming because I am keeping up my treatments regularly. And this, is the result that you get. Trust me, you'll love it. Maintenance. Be prepared to maintain this treatment. No, it is not a one-off treatment. No, it will not last you 12 months. Yes, you must be committed to maintaining your treatments about every three to four months for the best results. Now, the treatment will last about three to six months, depending on your metabolism, medications, lifestyle, those sorts of things. But it is best to retreat before it completely wears off 
to get the best results because then over time if you're coming and retreating about every three to four months we're going to get you this really nice consistent result now you might be annoyed with me because you might be thinking that's a lot of commitment but I promise you, you will thank me in five to 10 years time when your friends with those deep furrows are asking you why you look so good for your age. Now I'm going to give you a few bonus tips for your anti-wrinkle injections. It is a seriously amazing treatment, but it's not the only way that we can soften and prevent lines. So I do ask my clients to commit to proper skincare if they can also committing to regular skin treatments because we want healthy, plump, glowing skin that's going to make this look even better. Bonus tip number two, and this is sort of my disclaimer, you will be addicted to this treatment. It is one of the most satisfying treatments you can do, particularly for first timers. Once it, the treatment kicks in, you will love how smooth your face looks. You will love how much better your makeup goes on. And you will love that people will stop asking if you're angry or sad or tired, of all of those sorts of things. And it will look very natural. It will look very soft. People won't be able to pinpoint it. They'll just think, you look really fresh. If you found this video informative, please hit like. If you have questions, please pop them below. If you want to see more, don't forget to hit subscribe. And also, I want to know in the comments, have you started anti-wrinkle injections yet? Are you still considering this treatment? Have I made you want this treatment or have I turned you off it? Hopefully not. Thank you so much for watching. Again, please stay safe and I will be back soon to do your faces. Bye guys.